When subtracting large numbers, first rewrite the problem vertically as I have done. Notice I have two zeros in this problem. If you take it one step at a time, this won't be a problem. So begin the problem. 6 minus 7. Can you take 7 things away if you only have 6? No, so you're going to, you need to borrow. Come over to the tenths column, and there's only 0 there, so I need to borrow from the hundreds. The same as in the hundreds column, it's only 0. So I go to my thousands column. Instead of having 8,000, I now will have 7,000. I'm going to take that 1,000 and pull it over into the hundreds column. Instead of having 0, I will have 10. Now I can borrow from the hundreds. The 10 changes into a 9, and the 0 in the tenths column now turns into 10. Now I can borrow. The 10 changes into a 9, and the 6 will change into 16. 16 minus 7 is 9. 9 minus 3 is 6. 9 minus 5 is 4. And 7 minus 2 equals 5. So my answer now is 5,469.